Hey, what's up, everybody? Today we're talking about defensive tackle from Florida, Taven Bryant. This is serious. Whew. Cowboys are not messing around, all right? Rod Marinelli is at the Florida Gators Pro Day today doing one on one workouts, running him through the drills there at Florida Pro Day. And uh, Cowboys' interest is high, all right? Cowboys are looking at some big time heavy artillery defensive tackles. I think they're gonna they're gonna take a look at somebody here. Um, and Tim and Brian projected anywhere from the mid first to early second round. So right there in the threshold where the Cowboys are drafting, 19, would he be a pick there for the Cowboys? Um, I think some people are sleeping on him. Um, looking at his film, this guy impresses me because the first thing that jumps off the screen from him is his get off the ball. This guy, when the ball snapped, he's in there already, almost in the backfield. You know, he's got a really good rip move, power. I like what I see from this guy, man. I, the more and more I saw from him, the more I came away, you know, impressed with the player. And I can see why Rod Marinelli likes this player. And you put him in there. He's going to rush the quarterback, man. He, he is a havoc. He's a handful to deal with. I mean, he the plays that I've seen, the games that I've watched from him, he was just a menace. Uh, drawing double teams and uh, just looks the part, man. And he had a really good combine. You know, ran under 5, 4.98 at 40. Um, his short shuttle, 4.48, which is one of the faster times from the top defensive tackles so that kind of you know indicates the explosiveness the true explosiveness i'm talking the ball snapped or simultaneously i mean he yeah i mean this is good if you haven't seen it try to catch some of his film i have some clips here that, that are running here that you can see of him uh but for right now let's take a look at rod marinelli running the drills with tim and brian take a look at this
All right, guys, so that's Tevin Bryan, defensive tackle, Florida. Let me know what you guys think of this player. I think, um, you know, it's a player the Cowboys will be considering. You know, we're coming back down to earth. I know we had the conversation about trading up. and This is the kind of thing for players. But ultimately, you know, and what I've said before, I don't think the Cowboys would be wise to trade up for a player throwing multiple picks. So coming, coming back to reality here, number 19 pick. You know, we're still looking at linebackers. We're still looking at if somebody falls. Ultimately, I think the Cowboys are going to wait. You know, just taking a look at a lot of the players that they're visiting with doesn't really indicate that they're going to move up. Now, if they bring in a Derwin James or somebody like that, or a Bradley Chubb or somebody like that, you know, if they bring him into a third, then yes, you know, that, that might be something more realistic where they move up. But for right now, the guys that they're bringing in, I think, are players that, will, you know, they'll be able to pick. If the board is starting to get wiped out, they're, they're going to have a list of players. And um, do they have 19 first rounders? Jerry Jones kind of alluded to that they do, but they were going to go back and, you know, build the board and, and you know, confirm that. But pretty good, pretty good information there. But uh, I like him, man. I like him a lot. And I honestly, man, the Cowboys could go anywhere with the number 19 pick. If the board's getting wiped out, the guards are gone, wide receiver, more, or really whoever you like, you know, whatever your cup of tea is. If Brian's there, I would not have a problem with him, man. Upgrade the defensive line. We got, uh, you know, you know me. I've been saying we got to get bigger and we got to get better in the middle. Adding him there, upgrade. And gives you protection in case, you know, they don't bring back David Irving or if he has a knucklehead suspension. So let me know what you guys think in the comments. Any Florida Gator fans out there, let me know what you guys think of this guy here. I really came away really impressed with him from the games I've seen. But let me know in the comments, guys. And as usual, continue to like, subscribe, and share. And we'll see you for the next video. Thanks, guys.